So this question was asked in year 2016, Electronics and Communication in paper set 2, in which you have given two random variables x and y, which has a distribution of f of xy, xy is equal to x plus y, where x is lying from 0 to 1 and y is from 0 to 1. And the f of xy and xy is 0 other than these two limits. So you need to find out the probability of uh, x plus y is less than or equal to 1. So the NPTEL difference for this question is probability and random variables by Professor M. Chakravarti, uh, Department of Electronics and Electrical Communication Engineering, IIT Kharagpur. You can find reference in the lecture number 13, which is function of two random variables. So the useful data for this question is for a continuous random variable. x1 and y for a continuous random variable x and y the joint probability density function is denoted as f of xy xy and the probability for any reason r of two dimensional space space is given as P of XY belongs to region R is equal to given by integrating the F of XY over this region R XY dy dx. Now coming to the solution you have given F of XY x y is equal to x plus y where x is from 0 to 1 and uh, y is also from 0 to 1 and 0 otherwise. So in this question you need to find out uh, the probability of x plus y is less than equal to 1. So to find this probability x plus y is less than equal to 1 let us plot this graph x plus y right which is given by this graph where this point is 1 comma 0 and this point is 0 comma 1 this is your y axis and this is your x axis so this region is the x plus y less than equal to 1 and if you integrate this region integrate this region then you will get the probability of x plus y is less than or equal to 1. So this is your f of x y graph and if you integrate this region, this uh, sided region, then you will get the probability of x plus y is less than or equal to 1. So to integrate this region, let us consider a strip which is in the y direction and this line is denoted as x plus y is equal to 1. Now, to find this area, you need to integrate y from 0 to 1 minus x from this, for, from this equation and x limit as 0 to 1. Now, the probability of x plus y is less than or equal to 1 is given as y limit is from 0 to 1 minus x and uh, x limit is from 0 to 1 and you integrate this probability density function dx dy. Now when you put the probability density function 0 to 1 and this is 0 to 1 minus x and this is x plus y dx dy. So, this is your probability x plus y less than or equal to 1. When you integrate this x plus y with uh, y limit as 0 to 1 minus x and x limit as 0 to 1, you will get the probability of x plus y is less than or equal to 1. So now, this is your probability x plus y less than or equal to 1 is given, which is equal to integration from 0 to 1 as x limit and 
0 to 1 minus x, x plus y dy dx. So, you can integrate this by 0 to 1. You first integrate with respect to y. So, it becomes x plus y dy. And when you integrate this integral with respect to y, you will get 0 to 1 dx and this is xy plus y square over 2 and the limit of this integration from 0 to 1 minus x. Further, you can write this integral as 0 to 1 x into 1 minus x plus 1 minus x square upon 2 and the dx and when you integrate this you will get x square over 2 minus x cube over 3 plus x by 2 plus x cube by 6 minus x square by 2 and the limit of uh, this integration from 0 to 1 so this uh, cancel out with this x square by 2 and the remaining you will get x by 2 minus x cube by 6 limit from 0 to 1 so when you put this limit you will get 1 by 2 minus 1 by 6 which is equal to 1 by 3 and this is 0 0.33 so the correct answer for this question is 0 0.33 Thank <laughs> you.